Novak Djokovic is through to the semi-final of the Monte Carlo Masters. Novak Djokovic got revenge over Alex de Menor to book his place in the semi-final of the Monte Carlo Masters in a rollercoaster match that saw both men struggle to hold serve. The world number one survived 7-5-6-4 to earn his best result at the tournament since 2015, ending a nine-year wait to get beyond the quarters. Djokovic was back in the quarterfinal in Monte Carlo for the first time since 2019. The top seed had an opportunity to avenge his defeat to De Menor after losing to the world number 11 in the United Cup at the start of the year. Both men saved a couple of break points in their opening service games and there was nothing separating them throughout the first set as Djokovic was heard shouting over to his box halfway through. The Australian saved a set point before blowing a breakpoint chance of his own and he quickly had his back up against the wall again. De Menor saved two more set points before he finally succumbed to the world number one, sending the ball short to gift Djokovic a close, 77-minute opening set 7-5. The two-time former champion left the court for a break to change his clothes on what was a warm day in Monaco. Djokovic appeared to be on his way to victory when another de Menor error gave him the break early in the second. But the set turned into a roller coaster as the 36 year old was visibly struggled and made two crucial mistakes to immediately relinquish his advantage, sending the ball into the net before hitting it long. There were three more successive breaks as both men continued to spray errors off their rackets. Even though he found himself two games from the semifinal, Djokovic continued to double over in between points, clearly struggling with the physicality of the match. De Menor got the sixth break in a row as Djokovic blew a 40-15 lead, this time putting the ball in the net. The world number 11 finally ended the run of breaks as he held to level things at 4-4. Djokovic responded with a love hold but he still appeared frustrated with his form. The top seed managed to get the job done when he secured the eighth and final break of the match to book his spot in the semi-final. He finished the tough match with 26 unforced errors.